Hi, welcome back to Papa John's Pantry. Remember to like us on Facebook and subscribe to our channel on YouTube. If you have any questions or comments, reach out to me at papajohnspantry at gmail.com. Today we're making roasted uh, roasted potatoes. You're gonna, And this is one of those things that it doesn't need to be an exact. Make however much you want. Um, I'm cooking for four. I'm going to be using a whole Spanish onion, two bell peppers, and about one baked potato uh, baker potato size for each of us. All right, and then we're going to cut everything up, put it in a bowl. It's going to get a fourth of a cup of oil and three tablespoons of our Montreal steak seasoning and one tablespoon of parsley flakes. All right, so let's get to it. All right, we're going to cut up our rough chop up potatoes. Just when you do this, make sure they're all the same size so they bake evenly. I have the oven preheating at 350. Once these are done, they're gonna cook for, until they're golden brown, it should be about 45 minutes. I'm going to take a spatula and flip them once so that they brown on both sides. I'm using gold potatoes for this, but you can use, you can use any potato you want. I'm, Showing you how to make them, you can go off on your own culinary adventure and use different potatoes and different combinations of vegetables until you find your favorite. These peppers I'm going to cube. Same thing with the onions. Just tapping the seeds out and the, taking the cores out to the sink. If you want, I got a, there's a separate video on how to prepare onions as well as peppers. Move the camera, but you still can. Okay. So, all right. So we're gonna just we're, we're gonna rough chop this as well. Am I still? Yeah. All right. So I'm just gonna cut this up in the like fourths. And these are about the size of a quarter. A little bit bigger, depending on. But great big pieces because these you can eat these up with a fork. Yeah. You want to separate the onion pieces. About the same size with the with the bell peppers. It all depends on the size of veggies you get and how many times you're going to cut them, but... You could use red bell peppers, you could use the orange ones, the yellow ones, whatever you... Whatever you feel like using for this. Just showing you how to make a great... A great dinner side. Alright, so I'm going to move this cutting board since I'm done with it. Show you the rest of this. We're gonna use a fourth of a cup. Yeah, sorry. I'm gonna use a fourth of a cup of oil. 
vegetable oil. We're just going to throw that right in there. And that'll make everything stick to the potatoes. Plus it'll kind of fry them as they're baking too. I'm going to use four tablespoons of our steak seasoning. One, two, three, four, and then one tablespoon of parsley. All right, so we are going to, you can either use a spatula or if you want to just give these a shake. And since they already had grease on them, do anything else they're going to go directly on a baking sheet just make sure you uh you get them as level as possible 350 for about 45 minutes or so uh, but you set your timer for 20 minutes and then we're gonna we're gonna flip them around all right see you in 20 minutes all right so welcome back it's been 20 minutes on our roasted potatoes let's pull these out flip them around Ah. All right. All right, and everything is starting to brown up, which is exactly what you want. And after the next 20 minutes, you want to keep yours cooking longer. Keep them cooking longer. You know, all the if you like your, if you're one of those people that likes the, you know, like the the crispy parts of the lasagna or the or that kind of things. Stop it. You know, keep, keep baking them as long as you want. But 40 minutes on these is going to, well, 25 more minutes because I said 45. So I will see you in 25 minutes. All right, so our potatoes have been in for 45 minutes. They are browning. Um, some of you might like them just like this. They're squishy. They break easily with the uh, spatula, as you can see. Um, I'm gonna let them. I'm gonna let them roast a little longer, probably about another ten minutes or so. But uh, these are good to go. Cook, you know, this is something you cook them how you like them. If you like, if you like your veggies all dark, keep them, keep them cooking. All right. Thanks for watching the video.